fuck is you talking about? I'm joking, yeah, we here to talk about Ron Sumo and K Flock. Got into a backstage brawl at Rolling Loud, we here to talk about it. This one was on the dock, I just seen this one, we here to talk about it. I guess this is what uh started the Freddie Gibbs academics thing, because basically academics posted this and Freddie Gibbs was like, hey, bro, you better post when I do that to you, blah, 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 and then a little fiasco happened or whatever the fuck. So we here to talk about that real quick now. I'm not too familiar with these men. I know who they are. I heard a couple songs, but I didn't even know they had that much beef. So we just here to get into it. We ain't gonna waste no time. I ain't gonna sit here and sing no song or, or whatever the fuck. We just gonna get into it. Before that, hey, what's up, Sam? It's K.A. Hey, back in the time. K so good, he sleep with a cutter up a throne. You know the little nigga want to turn. We back in here, and we here to talk about this. Like, subscribe, help your boy, I'll help your boy, girl. You know what it is. You know the kid. You know I talk my shit in my fleas. You hear me? But anyways, let's get into it. Ron Sumo and K Flock got into a backstage brawl at Rolling Loud. Rolling Loud has been every hip hop head's ideal festival. For the for of course for the course of three days, the hottest names in hip hop and R and B, both old and young, gather in one city for a non stop turn up. The downside is that the festival hardly goes down without a few hiccups. The other day, Lil Durk was reportedly MIA for his set, which riled up fans. However, it seems like there was some conflict that went down backstage on Saturday. Footage emerged on Saturday night of Ron Sumo and K Flock squaring up backstage at Rolling Loud. As commotion broke out, the video seemingly shows Sumo getting surrounded by a group of Flock's people while getting attacked. Both Flock and Sumo acknowledged the rift afterwards on social media. Flock confirmed that he and his crew got into altercation with Sumo. Say, why me and my gang just beat the ish out of Ron Sumo and Bo God SB, SBL hero? In Rolling Loud N Word, Sumo tried to give me a five shaking. Give me a five shaking. Yeah, I told you wait till I catch you. He later added, y'all some chum. Sumo also chimed in on the matter, but he downplayed the severity of the incident. He showed a photo of his bloody hands before claiming that he and his friends ended up stripping a flock's crew of their clothing. N-words get beat out of their hoodie, he wrote. All my N-words still got their clothes, though. He added, N-words be with security getting beat on by a comedian four deep causing pain. Why N-words be 30 deep still losing? So, yeah. And there's footage of the scrap, which I can't put it onto YouTube because YouTube's weird. And, yeah. So what do y'all think about this? This is just a little story. This ain't too much. Now again, I ain't know these motherfuckers had beef like that. To be honest, I was surprised and kind of perplexed. I was like, oh y'all got you got some beef up. You got some beef up. You got some beef up. So yeah, I didn't even know this was a prior situation. This is gonna be like a very short video because like I don't really know the background semantics on this situation. To be honest, I just seen like yo, I was just more concerned with the Fetty Wap thing. I'm like, oh y'all was fine. <laughs> what the fuck happened here? Lil Drake missed the set. <laughs> Okay, where y'all had beef? Now, again, I don't know these niggas is around the same area. I think Ron Sumo is around the New York, New Jersey area, as well as K-Flock, so I would not be surprised if there's an issue. I heard K-Flock on, on a song recently. That shit was stupid, bro. I was like, yeah, hey, I was vibing. So I was like, okay. So, hey, we'll see what the fuck happens with this. I need some more background. If you know any situation, please leave that in the comments. But I don't know what the fuck's going on. If you are confused as well, shit, hopefully some nigga answers us. And yeah, even if you just write their names in the comments, shit, it might help a nigga recall some shit. But yeah, I'm perplexed. I wouldn't be surprised if this was some beef from beforehand. It is what it is. But of course, my nigga Ron Sumo going downplay. He doesn't want to bring that much, um attention to it especially if y'all gonna go do something back to them of course you know i don't know who won i don't know what it is you know what's funny kind of reminds me of remember when skinny from the nine and uh ybn uh ybn J oh sorry it's not ybn almighty anymore it's almighty j aka formerly known as ybn almighty j had like their issues and they fought for some fucking reason yeah this reminds me of that as well like i feel like they just caught with each other you know cameras was on they ain't, try, ain't no rap cap in this motherfucker and, and they square up and whatever it was what it was. Now, the fact you telling me four niggas against 30 and the, uh, the 30 niggas lost, I don't believe that. But we gonna see what the fuck happens with that situation as more information hopefully comes out on it. I'll talk about it. 
that's all I got to say for now. Yeah, this is a little bit short video. I'm just gonna throw it out one time for the one time. But yeah, like I said, put your comments down below because I'm confused and I want more information. What happened? Check out the links in the description. Check, watch the other videos and yeah, like, subscribe, help your boy. I'll help your boy grow. You know what it is, and you know I'm the kid. And I talk my shit. King of a town in this bitch, you hear me? But yeah, I'm gone. You already know what it is. It's the dawn of a town. Your friendly neighborhood KA signing out for today. Shlam Zoom P shot Alish Gang. Aye.